Hi, I am excited to welcome you to the Abundance Initiative. The Abundance Initiative is a two-year generosity initiative that we are undertaking together. If we rise to this challenge before us, we will build on those things that are already our strengths. We'll get even better at doing the things we're already good at. The members of First Baptist Church will learn and grow, connect with God, and minister to our neighborhood in new ways. This initiative will remove some of the barriers that have kept us from serving our neighbors more effectively. And we'll emerge from the next two years with a building that is welcoming and attractive, as safe and secure as we can possibly make it. I'm excited for this initiative. I'm excited for all that God is doing in and through our congregation. I'm excited for the future of First Baptist Church. Our primary goal is 100% participation. We want everyone who calls First Baptist home to be involved in this project. Our secondary goal is to raise $2.3 million over the next two years so that we can implement this vision that we believe God has given to us. We're excited for this future, but we can only get there if we work together. First, it's about being abundant people. More than half of what we hope to raise through this initiative will go to fund our regular operating expenses. Almost $650,000 a year will fund the things we're already doing. We feel like we're already on the right path forward. So this Abundance Initiative will fund our day in and day out expenses, our staff salaries, building upkeep and maintenance, our program costs and supplies. Each year you pledge and you give gifts to support these and other ministries of First Baptist Church. We're asking you to keep doing those things so that we can keep doing what we're already doing. For me, the most uh, wonderful thing about First Baptist Church is that we are trying to authentically live out um, what it means to be uh, followers of Jesus. The mission of this church is to serve the underserved, and I'm not sure that there's a lot of churches that have that mission, and I think this uh, physical location accommodates that mission. This church can really make a difference. For me, the greatest thing about this church is the sense of community that you get within the church, where you're always greeted with a smile, you know, people are just friendly, uh, but then that community reaches outward also and to the surrounding area and is just as open and welcoming to everyone. I'm, I'm very um, excited about where our church is moving and we have a very bright future here. This initiative is also about building an abundant place. So in addition to our regular operating expenses, we're also hoping to raise at least another million dollars to fund repairs, renovations, upgrades to the FBC building. This building is 60 years old. So it's been the site of worship services and programs that have helped people connect to God. Life-changing ministry has happened in this building. The ministries of First Baptist Church deserve the best space that we can provide. Flexible, useful, and safe spaces will allow us to fulfill our mission even more effectively. When I started attending the building planning committee meetings, I was unaware of the infrastructure problems that we have with this church. The, the repairs and improvements are important because of what this building is used for. I guess I look at some of these repairs and kind of compare it to the human body. I can't think of it too many people that are 58 years old that haven't been to a doctor to have bones fixed or to have teeth repaired or eyes examined or ears, things of this nature. So these are all things in the human body that go bad over a 58 year period. And the uh, same thing happens to a church. There's a lot that happens in this space and of course, outreach is, is so important, what we do outside this building, but to have a space that's, that is workable and works well is really important. We are an abundant people, building an abundant place so that we can move into the abundant future that God has prepared for us. The Abundance Initiative is also about our abundant 
future. We are here because previous generations at First Baptist Church met the challenges of their day and passed this ministry on to us. So now it's time for us to rise to the challenges we face and pass this ministry on to a new generation of First Baptist members. That means funding this building project without taking on any debt. It means using our resources as wisely as we possibly can. I feel it's incredibly important to make this investment in our building now um, so that the future generations that are to come can focus their efforts on mission and on um, the work that God wants us to do. So we pass along uh, our faith uh, to generation to generations. So we don't want our faith uh, to drop. We don't want our children's faith to drop like when they leave from home and or church. So we have to pass our belief to them. We don't want to leave behind something that the next generation would have to take care of. That's up to us now. Anybody that's connected with this church needs to give what they can, use their talents, and prepare for the generation ahead. I think it's important to pass on a strong foundation in this building to the future generations because that's what was done for us. There was a prior generation that saw the future and knew that we needed this building in this place. And now it's our job and our duty to pass along to the next generation. I am completely committed to this abundance initiative. I'm excited about what it means for our congregation. My family and I have spent time this summer talking about what it means for us and how we can contribute, how we can be involved. I'm asking you to think to talk together, to pray about how you can participate in this initiative. I'm asking you to listen to God's voice and respond. So come join me, my family, the rest of this congregation as we enter the Abundance Initiative together. My name is Evan Bever, and I am ready for abundance. 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 I'm Amy. And I'm Kevin. And, and we're, we're ready, ready for, for abundance. abundance.